Welcome to another episode of Nomsoli Explains. In this episode, we're going to continue our exploration of Campaign Logger by creating a campaign and creating our first log. I'll go into more steps in future episodes, but before we get started, please remember I really do need your help to grow this channel. It really, really is important to me if you leave a comment and tell me what you think I'm doing. Uh, give me suggestions of things to cover. Uh, and like, share, and subscribe. Uh, so that more and more people will be shown this channel. I really appreciate your help. Now, on the campaign logger. So we'll begin our exploration of campaign logger by creating a new campaign and making a log entry. So first we have to log in. I'll show you in a future episode how to create an account, but for right now, we'll assume you have one. Uh, we're going to be taken to our home screen here, which shows us our campaigns and our logs. Uh, I'm gonna skip over this part here and go straight into campaigns. And you can see here, I already have a couple in here, this is where I uh, do different uh, logs for my players. Uh, right now, I don't have any players invited, but I could. I'm going to create a new log by clicking on the plus sign here. And we're going to call this Num Solely Explains. And then you can uh, add a description. And then you have either an image URL, you can upload your photos here. Uh, you can show a gallery so that you can pick from images you've already uploaded. We're gonna upload an image and I'm gonna navigate over here to uh, my folder. And then I've got uh, a uh, logo here that I can use. And now I can hit save and you'll see that it's created a new uh, campaign with a logo here. If you ever need to change anything, just hit logo uh, manage, I mean, and then you can change anything you want to. You can update the title, change the URL, uh, anything that you need to do here. You can also upload logs that you've exported. That's what this download is for. We're going to just hit cancel for that and then uh, you can uh, delete it if you want to get rid of it. Uh, the download, like I said, allows you to back up your campaigns, which is a pretty good idea to do. I believe it saves it in JSON format, which means it's readable by a lot of different editors. So you can see here, there's no comment in here. What I'm gonna do right now is just make a simple log. I'm gonna go ahead and hit add. And now I've created a log. I'm gonna give it a title not going to be something super creative. I'm a little bit more creative with my games. Now, I don't normally put an image URL, but again, it works the same way. Uh, you can also upload log entries if you want to. We're going to hit save. Now we can go into log one, and now we can do log entries inside of log one. Our first log entry uh, we're going to give it a title. All good campaigns start with a session zero, I think. Uh, and then we're going to uh, put a thing in here and we're going to say, uh, we're going to first, you see these little symbols up here? They mean different things. We'll go over all of them at some point. Um, but you, we're going to put this symbol here for our organization. We're going to say party. And then we're going to say meets in a, and now we're going to choose a location. I believe that's this one right here. So now we have a, you see here, there's already a page that we can create just by clicking on it and a bar here. Uh, if we want to make a location here. And then, so we're going to click on party. 
uh, well, first I'm gonna hit log this and then we're gonna click on party. And now we've got a page where we can do private and public parts for the party. So that's the simple way that you can do this. Uh, if you wanna see more entries here, you can, well, I'll show you that in future episodes, but that's a simple way how to do this. And I'll go into more details on how to use this. Uh, you've got dice rollers over here where you can roll different types of die, including fate dice. Um, you can copy it to the clipboard. You can create managed generated uh, generators, random tables, so that you can do uh, demon names, heroes of the realm, all sorts of things like that. So these are great little resources for you, and I'll go through all of these in future episodes. Well, now we've created our first entry into Campaign Logger. We will come back next time and do more. But until then, happy gaming.